Gemini 3 just dropped and almost everyone is using it wrong. People are busy making small laughs and simple games, but they are ignoring what actually matters, which are tools that real businesses need, like AI voice agents. That's why in this video, I will show you exactly how you can use Gemini 3 to build fully custom AI voice agents with zero coding knowledge just by typing a few simple prompts. And I will also show you how you can connect it directly into your Google Calendar so you can book events automatically for you. So if that sounds interesting, let's get started. Now the first thing that you have to do is to go over to aistudio.google.com which I will also leave a link for in the description below. And then you need to come over here where it says supercharge your apps with AI and select on create conversational voice apps. Since you want to be able to use Gemini's different voices in order for your agent to be able to speak. And then what you have to do is to come over here and describe your idea. Now let's say you wanted to build a voice agent for a Miami cleaning company. All you would have to do is to find that company's website. Let's assume it's this company for our example. And once you find the website, simply copy all the information that is inside it and then go over to an LLM of your choice. It can be ChatGPT, it can be Gemini 3, it can be whatever LLM you want. Simply paste in everything you just copied and say something like, give me a prompt that I can use to build an AI voice agent for this company. Don't make it super long, neither super short. Keep it medium length. And then simply come over here and click on enter. And boom, as you can see, ChatGPT just gave us this prompt. So all we have to do is to simply come over here and copy it. And then come back over to Google AI Studio. Simply paste it in over here. And then come over here and click on build. Now, obviously, you can manually write this prompt yourself. I just show you a way that you can do it way faster and with way more accuracy since you're able to copy all the information about that company from their own website. And as you can see, Gemini 3 is currently building a voice agent. Now, while it's doing that, I want to show you all the options that you have inside Google AI Studio. And the first one is to save all your code over to GitHub, which if working on a big project with a lot of people and a lot of developers can come out very handy simply because you can upload this code to GitHub and then the people you're working with can access that code and transform it however they want. Now you also have the option to simply download all the code inside your computer by clicking on the download button over here and you also have the option to save a copy of the code into your Google Drive so you can always have a well-stored backup. Then you obviously can share this app by clicking over here in the share button with any Google account that you want and finally you can deploy the app so everyone with a link can access it which I will show you how to do in a bit. But for now let us wait till Gemini 3 is done creating and boom as you can see Gemini 3 just finished creating a voice agent and it is prompting us to allow it access to our microphone which I'm going to do by coming over here and clicking on allow. And then we have the AI voice agents interface where we can come over here and start a call with our agent. Now, this didn't actually take too much time, guys. I only waited for one or two minutes. So this is actually very fast. But being fast is useless if it doesn't actually work. So let's come over here, give it a call and test it out. To do that, I will simply come over here and click on start call. Hello, thank you for calling Green Cleaning Service Miami. How can I help you today? Hey, I would like to know some information about your offers. Of course. We offer a variety of cleaning services, including weekly, bi-weekly, monthly, and last-minute cleanings. We focus on using eco-friendly products and provide you with upfront pricing, so there are no surprises. What kind of service are you interested in? I'm mainly interested in cleaning my house. We would be happy to help with that. Our residential cleaning services cover a thorough cleaning of your home, ensuring every detail is taken care of. We use eco-conscious products to keep your home clean and healthy. Would you like to tell me a bit more about your home size so I can provide you with some more information? Uh, sure, my home is two-bedroom, one-bathroom apartment. Thank you for that information. For a two-bedroom, one-bathroom apartment, we can provide a thorough cleaning. Our cleaners are punctual and pay deep attention to detail. Would you be interested in learning about our pricing or scheduling a cleaning? Yes, yeah, sure. Let me know about your pricing and I would also be interested in scheduling a cleaning. For a two-bedroom, one-bathroom apartment, our pricing typically ranges from insert price range, depending on the level of cleaning and any special requests. 
we can provide you with a more precise quote once we have more details. To schedule, could you please tell me your name, address, and preferred date and time for the cleaning? We also have flexible scheduling options, including last-minute cleanings. Yes, my name is Damian. My address is Miami, Florida, and my email address Thanks. is damian at gmail.com. Got it. And what is your preferred date and time for the cleaning? Also, are there any special requests you have for the cleaning? Let's do Monday at 2 p.m. I have noted Monday at 2 p.m. We will send you a quote shortly with all the details. Is there anything else I can help you with today? No. And boom, guys, this is honestly super impressive. We literally managed to build a full AI voice agent that includes basically all the information that is inside that company's website just by typing one simple prompt, which, if I'm going to be honest, is completely insane. But we can improve this even further. Because right now, if we tell it to book this appointment, it cannot actually go and do that since it doesn't have access to our Google Calendar. So in order for us to make this AI voice agent actually functional and useful to a business, we need to give it access to our Google Calendar. So how are we going to do that? Well, all we have to do is to simply come over here and say, hey, I want to connect my Google Calendar into this app. So every time I book an event, the app actually goes and books that event in my Google Calendar. Tell me exactly how we can do it step by step. And then we simply come over here and we click on send. And now what Gemini is going to do, it is going to analyze all the steps that we need to take. And it's basically going to tell us exactly what we need to do step by step. And boom, as you can see, this is the message that Gemini returned to us. Basically tells us to load the Google Calendar identity services. Then it also tells us to create a Google Calendar hook to define the tool and to also handle the tool calls. And as you can see over here in the suggestions, it gives us this already pre-built message where it says Google Calendar connection, which if I click, it basically tells that it should go and make all these changes in order for us to be able to connect our Google Calendar. So all I'm going to do is I will simply come over here and send this over. And boom, as you can see, this is exactly what Gemini just did. And it also updated the UI over here, but we still are not connected in our Google Calendar and that is simply because it is missing some very key information. So in order to get this very key information, I will simply come over here and ask Gemini. Hey, give me all the steps that I need to take to enable this inside the Google Console. And then I will simply come over here and click on Enter. So now Gemini is going to go and give us the exact steps that we need to follow inside the Google Console in order to enable the integration for Google Calendar. Because right now we haven't. And Google is basically not allowing access to our app to access our Google Calendar. And boom, as you can see, gave us exact step-by-step -step instructions of exactly what we need to do. So let's go and follow them. Now, the first thing that we need to do is to go over to Google Console. So I will simply come over here and click on this link, which is going to bring us over in this interface over here. Now, the first thing that we need to do is to come over here to the top and click on the Projects icon. And we need to come over here and create a brand new project. Now I'll name this project Voice Agent. And then I'll simply come over here and click on Create. And boom, as you can see, our brand new project is successfully created. So now we simply need to come and select it from over here. And now every change that we're going to make in our settings is going to be for this project specifically. Now the next thing that we need to do is to enable the necessary APIs. So in the left sidebar, we need to navigate over to APIs and Services. And then we need to come over here and click on Library. And this interface is going to pop up where we simply need to come over here and search for the Google Calendar API. And then we will be able to see it over here. So all we have to do is to simply click on it. And then we need to come over here and click on Enable. And boom, as you can see, the Google Calendar API was successfully enabled. And then the next thing that we need to do is to also enable the Generative Language API for Gemini. So let's come back over to Library and search for the Gemini API. Simply click on top of it and then come over here and click on Enable as well. And boom, we successfully managed to enable this. And now the next step that we have to do is to come over here and navigate over to the auth consent screen. And once we're here, we simply need to come and click on get started. Now we simply need to give this a name. I will name it voice agent and I will select my Gmail over here. Then I'll click on next. Then we need to come over here and select external and click on next. Then simply input your email address over here, which is exactly what I'm going to do. And then come over here and click on next. Then simply agree to the terms, click on continue. And then come over here and click on create. And boom, we successfully managed to do this step as well. And now what do we have to do is to come over here and click on create 
auth client. So once we do that, we simply select what type of application this is going to be. I will select web application. Then we simply give this a name. I will leave it exactly as it is over here. And then if we come back to Gemini, you can see that we need to input our local link URL, which to find, we simply have to come over here and ask Gemini, hey, what is my local link URL? And simply click on enter. And as you can see over here, it explains to us exactly how we can see it. Ways to find, you actually have to deploy your app. So make sure you come over here, you click on deploy app. Then you come over here, you click on create project simply give a name to your project i will call it name for this example and then i will come over here and click on create new project and then simply come select your project and set up your billing which you can do by coming over here and setting this up yourself and once you're finished setting up your billing your project will be deployed which means that you will be able to come over here and copy your local host from your link url so then you need to come over here and in the authorized javascript origins simply click on add url and paste in the link you just copied and after you do that simply come over here and click on create and boom this is going to create your auth client id which all you have to do is to simply come over here and copy and then come back over to google ai studio and say something like this is my client id make sure you embed it inside the app and then simply paste in the client id that you just copied and click on enter and boom as you can see gemini just successfully embedded a client id inside our ai voice agent since over here says that we are successfully connected in our google calendar so now all we have to do is to simply give this a call and test it out so we'll come over here click on start call hello thanks for calling green cleaning service miami how can i help you today hey i would like to book an appointment so you guys can come and clean my house Absolutely. I'd be happy to help you with that. Could you please tell me your name, address, and the size of your home? Uh, sure. My name is Damian. My address is Miami, Florida, too. And the size of my home is a two-bedroom, one-bathroom apartment. Thank you, Damian. And what type of service were you looking for today? We offer standard cleaning, deep cleaning, and move-in, move-out cleaning. I'm mainly looking for uh, standard cleaning. All right. And what date and time works best for you? We are available Monday through Saturday from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. Uh, let's do Monday at 5 p.m. And boom, now if we come back over in our Google Calendar, we can see that this event was successfully created for 5 p.m. on Monday, exactly as we told to our AI voice agent. Now if you want access to all the prompts that I use to build this AI voice agent, you can click the second link in my description and join the school community where I save all the assets from all the videos that I have done. And if you want help with selling systems like this to businesses for thousands of dollars, make sure you click the top link in my description and you come and check out my AI SaaS builders community in which I have personally helped countless people just like you get the first high paying client in the shortest amount of time possible. And as a bonus, I'm currently running an offer in which Everyone that joins till the end of November gets a personal one-to-one -one call with me where they can ask me any question they might want and I can guide them on exactly how they can get their first high-paying client. So make sure you take advantage of this offer and come and join me and 140 members that are interested in AI and have already made money with it, just like you want to do right now. So make sure you click the top link in my description and you come and check out my AI as builders community and I will be waiting to help you inside but also YouTube thinks you're going to enjoy this video in which I build an AI voice agent using just any 10 and VAPI so make sure you go and watch that next and I will see you over there